salam, shalom, peace, namaste, sat sri akal, Allah abho and Jai Janendra. Jai Janendra. Hamzor Hama Ashabad. <laughs> we are with America, American Muslim Institution and also with uh, Adams Center. And the significance of this event is Muslims and Christians form about half of the world population. And it puts an obligation on us to create a better world for all of us. And it is our responsibility. And this is the beginning where we can celebrate. It's a blessing. It's an auspicious occasion that uh, Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, his birthday and Jesus' birthday have fallen at the same time. And what better time to start an event like this where people can come together and celebrate their birthdays. These two men, Jesus and Muhammad, have done so much to the world to create a better world for us and this is an auspicious occasion and that's what we are doing and that is the significance of the event. We made history at the footsteps of the Lincoln Memorial. It's never happened before. This is the first time and inshallah, God willing, uh, there is more to come, more to do and we as people have to take this step. Memories are calling Decorations are On a green Christmas tree But I have a blue, 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 blue Christmas Just that a fool is होती है चमन की जीनत जिंदगी हो मेरे परवान के सूरत या रब इम की शम से हो मुझको मुहाबत या रब uh, my name is Anwar. I am I'm from Montgomery County Muslim Foundation and we are a partner of this great event. I am extremely pleased, extremely uh, delighted to be part of this historic event. I think it's a merger of two great civilizations and uh, inshallah it is going to be further strengthened in course of time. And I'd like to con uh, the congratulate uh, uh, Mr. Mike Goss and Mr. Islam Siddiqui for this great endeavor. I hope this will uh, it will spread a beautiful message across the world. Thank you very much. Have a great evening. Thank you. I really admire what this gentleman uh, has been doing. Uh, the first one when he joined with the ISIS and now he's uh, doing this peaceful program again. i uh, just like to share what the Quran said, Islamic uh, teaching said, uh, wa rasulahu wa la uh, which means obey the God and obey his messengers and do not dispute, do not fight among each other because that's going to make our might, that's our going to make our powers gone, totally gone. And Allah said, the God said, wasbiru, be patient. Patient is bitter, but the result is better. الوداع وجب الشكر علينا ما دعا لله دا Oh the white moon rose over us from the valley of Wada and we all wait to show gratefulness where the call is to Allah أيها المبعوث فينا جئت بالأمر المطاع جئت شرفت المدينة مرحبا يا خيراتا يا ملائكة يا حبيب سلام عليك صلوات الله عليك أولى يا نبي سلام عليك يا رسول سلام عليك يا حبيب سلام عليك This is a season that has always been with everything to do with peace and goodwill and the goodwill of messages to men. And it's not just for Christians, 
the Hanukkah for Jews, and now in this year, we have the serendipity to have the Milad, the birth of the, the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, uh, to, sell, to join us all together. You know, there are many things that differentiate us and differentiate us in our religions, but there are so many other things that join us together and so many common bonds that make us all part of the same family. We all worship the same God. We all appreciate that same message. And I think we all hope that this year, 2016, we can continue this celebration of peace and goodwill. This is a terrific event. I think um, the first time in 300 years that the Prophet Muhammad's birthday almost coincides with Christmas, an opportunity for Jews, Muslim, Christian, Buddhists, uh, and every people of all faiths to get together in front of the Lincoln Memorial. This is what the United States needs to stand for, to crowd out the voices of hate that are trying to overtake our country. Thank you, Mike and Adams, for organizing this event. Thank you. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. Happy New Year. Good tidings we bring to you and your kin. Good tidings for Christmas and Happy New Year. Oh, bring us a figgy pudding. Oh, bring us a figgy pudding. Oh, bring us a figgy pudding and a cup of good cheer. Good tidings we bring to you and your kin. Good tidings for Christmas and a happy new year. We won't go until we get some. We won't go until we get some. We won't go until we get some. So bring some out here. Oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleaming whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight o'er oh, the rampers we was so gallantly streaming, and the rocket's red glare, the bombs bursting in air, gave proof through the night that our flag was still there. Oh, say does that star signal then I yet Only in America. What you are seeing here is people who have come together from around the world, from every aspect of the human experience, faith and non-faith, all of us who have faith in the future, faith in our children, faith in each other. And I pray that we will all come out of this experience building unity, connection, listening, affirmation, and responsibility for ourselves and for the future. And I certainly thank Brother Mike and Brother Rizwan for making this possible and for bringing all of us here today. This would not happen if it were not for the hope that we have in the future and the gifts which the Lord has given us in great abundance, starting with each other. Thanks be to God. To reduce the turmoil and strife that we are witnessing in the world today, we must learn to connect with each other as part of one big human family. We, the followers of Hindu tradition and scriptures, have a term for it, and it is Vasudev Kutumbakam. People of various faiths must embrace the concept of mutual respect, accept the differences among us, and cherish the common good that we all share. Only then we will not be tempted to pass judgment or any other form of negativity towards each other. Instead, we'll work together to uplift the humanity, preserve environment and the nature. And that the fir first Noel, the angels did say, was to certain poor shepherds in fields as they lay, in fields as they lay, keeping their sheep on a cold winter's night that was so deep. Noel, 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 born is the King of Israel.
My name is Stefan Solat. This has been a wonderful co-mingling uh, of faiths uh, on the occasion of Hanukkah, Christmas, and Maulid coming together within the same couple of weeks. And we need more interfaith dialogue and music of the kind that we've had today. And I was excited to be here to part of this event. And Mike had been a great event for today, particularly it has been the interfaith and what to show uh, our community uh, and also the neighbors here. And this great to celebrate this Christmas and uh, the uh, birth of Prophet uh, Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Oh, beautiful, for spacious skies, for amber waves of rains, for purple mountain majesties above the fruited plains. America, America, God shed his grace on thee and crown thy good with brotherhood from sea to shining sea. <laughs> We thank you all for your dedication, your passion, your love for peace, harmony, and respect. I want to thank Brother Mike for his leadership and dedication uh, in helping and leading, organizing this. Uh, uh, we appreciate his spirit uh, in bringing this together in this season of peace. As you have heard, you know, uh, as uh, we have so much in common. God has told us in the Holy Quran that he has created us as nations and tribes so that we may get to know one another. And this event absolutely is in that spirit. Adam Center, thank you very much. Aligarh Alumni Association, Washington, D.C. These are in alphabetical order. Aligarh Muslim University Alumni Association, America Together Foundation, American Muslim Institution, Islamic Society of Washington area, Minaret of Freedom Institute, Montgomery County Muslim Foundation, Muslim Community Center, the International Cultural Center, UMA Interfaith Alliance, United Maryland Muslim Council, Universal Peace Federation, World Association of NGOs, and the World Muslim Congress. Thank you very much, and you have been a part of this big history. First time it has happened under the steps of Lincoln Memorial. Thank you, thank you, thank you.